Welcome and welcome back. I'm Martin and today I'm really excited. And not only because Emergence Audio came out with a wonderful new textural library, the Clarinet Textures, and not only because today is Women's Day and not only because I wrote a demo track and Emergence Audio accepted it as one of their official demos and you can find it on the playlist. No, this is the very first library where I participated in the sound design and created some of the presets. So if you get this library, you adapt some of my babies and I'm really happy for the opportunity that Emergence Audio gave me to work on this and to develop this. And I suggest as always, now we listen to the demo track that I wrote behind the hills. Then I will go a little bit in detail about what the demo track is all about. And then we talk about Claren textures. Those Hills was written completely using libraries from Emergence Audio, except the low booms. But for low booms, just use whatever percussion library you have. And there are six tracks from the clarinet textures. And what's pretty neat, even for the expandables, this time I used other libraries from Emergence Audio. So I used the violin textures and the cello textures. They sound like this. So if you don't know them yet, on my channel you find the reviews even for the violin textures and the cello textures. Then it's getting a little more chords. And I used even the wonderful soprano textures. The soprano textures, they provided precisely this. are so lovely, wonderful sounds, really. Yeah, combining those, you know, you get the idea how the background sounds. really beautiful but the big big star today is clarinet textures and to be honest you know i'm a big fan of emergence audio i love their libraries there is even the video of source code that i did where i went a little bit into that wonderful wonderful infinite motion engine showing you what you can do with that beast because you don't have to live with those sounds out of the box but clarinet textures is the complete opposite to steel tongue which I like for the gritty and the angry and, and the, you know, the, the dirty sound. Clary in the textures is a complete different baby and it's really warm. It's really natural and they sampled a lot of, lot of really cool 
pretty useful articulations. Let's listen track by track what clarinet textures is providing. I'm starting here with the long vibrato. Combining it with the fast vibrato. Those sounds there are so wonderful. And maybe you see it here, I worked a lot with panning, so I distributed the sounds in the stereo field. I have here a pad, the cosmic moons. That's so beautiful. And then one thing that I really liked in this library are the trills. There are half tone trills, there are full tone trills. And at the very end, just to show you, I did it again with the trills, but this time I worked here with the expression. So you can really set an accent with those features to have these natural elements in your tracks. So beautiful. And then here I do have the breath vibrato. And use your modulation wheel, use your expression. And then yeah, if, if you take all those clever and the textures together, we get this wonderful, beautiful sound. Maybe we can start here. So yeah, what do you get if you buy um, clarinet textures? You get more than you will digest in one week. I can promise you this. So everything starts, oh here I even have the staccatos which I didn't use in the track because I didn't want to have it, you know, too full. Even those, they are really cool and you always have the main page and the affix page. In this case, you can hear there's a lot of convolution. I switched this off. So they did even a wonderful job sampling it in a very, very dry room. So there you choose then how wet the sound should be. You have here even the delay, which you can sync to the tempo of your door. how wide you want it. lots of stuff to play with you start if you want with the init clarinet textures instrument this is the infinite motion engine where you do have always two channels and for each channel you can choose which articulation you want and then obviously the volume and the panning and the ADSR and the cut of the resonance the panning all this can be automated by the engine but in the video of source code I talked in depth already about that engine and then you have the FX page really really cool and yeah this is just the init. So you, in this case, you do have um, the fast vibrato and the pure vibrato. Even this I like. It's a very um, fast attack. You can, it's a textural library, but you can play melodic lines. I mean, it's not legato really, but in my track, even how many lines and, and melodies and counter melodies did I have? You can do this easily. And then if you are not happy with this and or if you easily get bored or if you are just too lazy to try this out, here are the snapshots. And there are a lot, a lot of snapshots. The correlated ones, like for example, the breath vibrato, just to. Mm. 
where they always put in channel A and channel B the same sound if you go for the correlated ones. Then there are the infinite pads and those pads are magical. Obviously I can't go through all of them but let's just load in two or three. The falling infinite I'm quite sure you didn't expect this. But that's a cool one. That's really a cool one. And um, what else can we do? The full moon. <laughs> Is this cool? Is this cool? There is really, really a lot, a lot, a lot of stuff in this um, over the air. And I think now you get an idea how different they can be one from the other. Solaris, infinite pad. Let's try this one. Lots and lots, as I said. And we are only in the snapshots. We are only in the snapshots. Uh, I didn't even talk about the maybe coolest feature of this. Then there are the pulses. You can imagine what the pulses do. Yes, they pulse. And always have a look a little bit at the engine, what it's doing and what's going on there. It's worth learning to use this engine, the soft ruptures. Lots of nice stuff. Then there are even the swells, the breath vibrato just to listen to a few really beautiful really natural I like it I like it a lot uh, maybe I'm a little bit biased might be on this one but anyhow I, I like the sound I really like the sound is that so completely different from your classical clarinet? <laughs> then yes, apart from this, you do have the dimensions. In the dimensions, you get the um, single articulations, if you want, the flatter atonal. This one is pretty useful. Then as I already said, you do get the trills in the half step. You do get the trills in the reverse or then in the whole step. Even here, yeah, the FX page and the main page. And those are the dimensions. But it wouldn't be Emergence Audio if they wouldn't have created a whole bunch of multis. And those multis, as it once was, are pure magic. I will play through some of the multis now. to oblivion wonderful 
wonderful, wonderful setting the sun. Let's play this one. stream if you're interested let me know in the comments we might make a live stream again just noodling around with Amagen's audio because all their libraries do have some magic and in this one for me it's the natural sound or the natural tones really really well done under reality I'm sorry I will I will play another one So that's clarinet textures by Emergence Audio. We went through the init and then the snapshots. We went through the dimensions. We went through the multis. The enterprise, and that's really amazing, is $64 for a library that can play in the free player. You do not need the full version of Contact for this. So even this is something that makes Emergence Audio stand out as their libraries really do have a fair price and they all come in the free player. Another plus, in my opinion, for Amagen's Audio. One of the reasons why even there are amongst my favorite developers. The full price then will be $99. And in the description of the video, you can find an affiliate link. So if you would like to support me and my channel, you can buy the library through the link in the description. There is no extra cost for you, but I get a little commission to finance you know, my time and, and my passion and, and all this. And I think we are through. Thanks for staying with me until the end. I really had fun writing the demo track Behind Those Hills. I'm really happy that it made it on the official playlist on Emergence Audio website. I'm really happy that some of the presets have been created by me. This was a huge chance that Emergence Audio gave me. And thanks again for that chance. Really, really happy. I think that's it. See you in the next video or on the next live stream. Make good music always. Bye-bye.